Hello there. Wait, it's crooked. How do I make it not crooked? Hi, so today I'm going to be reacting to my SAT subject test reactions. I took biomolecular and math too, and I'm reacting with my lovely Asian mother who has Hi, immigrated everybody. from China. And I know you guys really liked the last one, so I'm doing this one again. Hopefully I don't let you guys down too much because I know I did not do well on the test because I skipped a bunch for That's math so and I ran out of time and then bio is just bio and we didn't really learn that stuff in AP bio, so it was a little bit difficult. So, I mean, regardless, we're just still gonna do it. So the scores came out at like noon Hawaii time and I had to wait until now where it's like 4 p.m. So I waited for four hours just for you guys so I could film this. So you're welcome. I would like to urge you to please not skip the ads because I'm going to use this money to hopefully relieve some financial burden from my parents to pay for college because it is really expensive. So if you care, then please don't skip the ads. Thank you. Mesa looks really, look really dark. No, 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 but yeah, dark. Close it. Yeah, there we go. There it is. Okay, mom, are you excited? Yeah. <laughs> Always excited. Do you have a score prediction? <laughs> 700. Okay. Oh, 700. Oh. Okay, bio was a 680. <laughs> and SE, ugh, what's it? math was a 720. So yeah, that's about it. Oh, math is 720. Yeah, I said it's 700. This right here is the face of someone who's in shock because they got a low test score. Not because they studied a lot and expected to do well, but because they usually just get by in life not studying that much and just still somehow clutching out on her scores. And I think that this is because I usually in class learn the material and I somehow just am able to dig it from my memory when we're tested on it, even though I don't really study for it. But in this case, there's stuff that I straight up just have never learned in my life, so you just can't really BS yourself out of that because there's a penalty for guessing on this. When I practiced for bio, I got like a yeah. 590, mm -hmm. so this is better, I guess, that I got a 680. Yeah. It would have been good if I could at least hit 700, but that's okay. Uh, science is not what I want to do, so I'm like okay with it. But I think I might retake math just because I think I can get an 800. Like, it's not that hard to get an 800 if you just study more and time yourself better. So I just need to practice more for it. And yeah, maybe I'll take like August because in June I'm going to take the SAT. Your bio is good too. When you take AP bio. Yeah, but the school yeah, but the school AP bio yeah, is really different award. from the actual subject test because I did really well in AP bio. Like I got an A both semesters, and I got like a recognition award for it too. So I feel like so if you practice a little bit, then maybe you just have to like know really different time. stuff. So it's like kind of annoying because you can't just use your knowledge. You have to learn even more stuff. But my brain is done. Like it's done. <laughs> and at that time you were busy, didn't practice. Yeah, I was busy because I was trying to study for APs, yeah. so I like didn't have time so to be fine. studying for. Yeah, I understand. This. Yeah, that's okay. Yeah, it's okay. We don't want to do anything in yeah, bio, okay. so it's fine. But well, expect it. We're gonna try to get so an 800 in math in August, so stay tuned for that. Mm -hmm. I like. Uh, I don't even know like what to say about it. I'm disappointed, but at the same time, I'm not like necessarily sad because because this is what I deserved like I didn't deserve to do any better so it's okay I'm usually that type of person who doesn't study that hard for school stuff and then I still do really well which is kind of like how I did in bio like I never really studied a lot but I just learned everything in the classroom and I remember it so I can just apply on the test but for this bio test you actually need to like learn new stuff and I didn't bother doing that so yeah, that was probably my downfall. And next time, I guess I have to study for it. Well, for, for math, because like for bio, I'm done with that. I really don't want to, um, I really don't want to do bio again, so I'm just not. And 
yeah, we're just gonna go for math two and hopefully that goes better. Math subject two, I was 50th percentile. So I love that for me because I know that like 80 percentiles get 800. So a lot of people get perfects on the math two and I just really do think that I'm capable of that and I'm better than this. Here's me doing a disclaimer because everyone is so freaking sensitive. But you guys are still going to comment something, pff, even though I did this. Because y'all don't even watch the whole video, and then you just go and attack me. But it's fine, whatever, okay. I just want to say that I am in no way trying to brag to you that I think I can do better on the Math 2 SAT. I just think that an 800 is a lot more achievable than, let's say, me trying to do, like, English or something social studies related. Because I cannot do that to save my life. And... I got an 800 on the SAT, regular SAT, on the math portion, so I just feel like it's possible for me to get it, even though the math too is definitely a lot harder, but I'm just saying that math is a stronger subject for me, so I want to try to do the best that I can do, and I'm not trying to diss you, so chill, okay? I'm just trying to compare myself to myself, which is what you should do as well. There's really not much to say and there's really not much to be happy about because I didn't study enough and it shows and please don't comment down below about saying how I'm ungrateful or whatever because like I know I'm better than this so I'm comparing myself to myself and I'm not saying that if you don't get like an 800 you're like bad or whatever I'm just saying that personally I know I can do better and I need to do better because I am trying to get merit-based financial aid so I need those scholarships and grades are the only way that I'm going to get them so I don't really need your negative comments about things about my life so thanks hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video still and stay tuned hopefully i'm t when i take the sat in june my results turn out a little bit better and i'm happy that i got to make another sat video because i know i haven't made one in a really long time and hopefully i can do some like fall step by step sats in the future like i'm gonna show you guys me doing the math section obviously not the math 2 sat but like the real sat because i got an 800 on that so not the most exciting video but i think that's about it and i'll see you guys in my next video you can follow me on instagram at kcatelli if you want to see what other aspects of my life there are so see ya bye I said it's so